Well, good morning, good evening, good afternoon, whatever your current life situation is. Hello, YouTube. This is Jeffrey Kite back again with another episode of Kite's Curiosities. Well, I promised myself I was not ever going to buy another Fairfield box again. But temptation just got me. <laughs> Uh, just, I hadn't seen these in a while, and that kind of helped matters. And I've been seeing them come up in the Walgreens and the CVSs lately. Just passed on them and passed on them and passed on them, and then I just, like, I was like, ah, what the heck, why not? <laughs> let's, let's see what's inside. I don't think I'm going to be pulling anything big that says one in four. Contain a hit. You can look for random inserted cards, packs, parallels, autographs, and more. So I, I like my autographs. So maybe, maybe there's an autograph in here. Maybe there isn't. I don't know. But uh, let's see. Sometimes people can look. And you can. It's got a serial number on it somewhere, and you can kind of track when it was done up or something like that. So, I don't know. Let's get the cracking it open. Let's see here. So, it open at the bottom of here. I think that's what everybody does. All right. Is anything good in there at the top? Nope, nothing's at the top. All right, here we go. Let's see what we come up with here. First of all, our pack. Oh, a 1990 score series, too. Oh, yes. Uh, I don't know. I mean, you, you can pull some good rookies out of here. You're not getting the Emmett Smith. He was in the score traded. But you can get some guys who um, are in their college uniforms that have gone on to be in the college Football Hall of Fame, and they make good autograph requests out of that. So, we'll see. All right, let's see here. What we got here? We've got uh, Deshaun Kaiser. Instant daily impact to hit. Looks like yeah, it's all going to be those hit cards that I don't particularly care for, but whatever. And we got Maurice Hurst. Okay, that's nice. Got the Michigan. Emblem on his, on his helmet. I got John Lovett. Jaron Ely. Hassan Haskins. Uh, Kenneth Walker the third. Michigan State guy. Okay. Chris Autumn Bell. Kyron Williams. Oh, there's my man right there, Desmond Ritter. Desmond Ritter. Yeah, so the Falcons. Oh, yes. That's my other boy right there, Malik Willis from Liberty University. Yes. I've been wanting to pull a Malik Willis card. Fantastic. I hate that it's sage and it doesn't have the Liberty emblem on it, but... It's a Malik Willis card nonetheless. So can't wait to get that out into the mail to him. Let's see. Angle that down a little bit. There we go. Get that out in the mail to him. Hopefully someday here pretty soon. Season's about over, so I'm going to have to wait until training camp opens up in 2023. Very happy to get Malik. And my boy Desmond. All right, let's see what else we get. Bernard Berrien. That's a pretty good card. Man. Oh, Mike Glennon. Tops Chrome. That's a sharp looking card right there. Very nice. Justin Tuck. Ooh, Michael Stonebreaker. Very nice. 
I don't know if he's made the College Football Hall of Fame yet. I know he was an All-American at Notre Dame. He was on their 1988 National Championship team. Yep, consensus All-American. I thought so. Serious injuries from car accident in 89. He was able to return. Be an All-American caliber linebacker in 1990. Very nice. Very nice. I think I think I might try to track him down TTM there and see when come up with. I like that. Set him up. There you go. Okay, this this turned out to be a pretty good box, regardless of what anybody else might think. Let's see here. We got how's this? Ooh, Kyle Brady. Very nice, Kyle Brady. Rookie card. He was decent, decent tight end. I got Dante Pettis. Yeah, here is this Eric Martin, old LSU receiver. Yeah, there he is, Eric Martin. Very good. Nice. He does TTM, or he he did at one time. I got him on his LSU Collegiate Collection card years ago. Isaiah Spiller. Another Isaiah Spiller. Okay. Mohamed Ibrahim. Gary Clark, very underrated receiver. He was so good for so long. Uh, oh, this is his all Madden team card. That was pretty neat. Okay. Okay, I see that they had all Madden team. Very good receiver. Oh, yeah, here. Building blocks. We got Bobby Ingram, Rick Meyer. He does TTM. Got something out special for him. Hopefully, I can get it back. And who's this? Raymond Harris? Yep. Okay. All right. That has potential to get some TTM ink on it. Uh, Josh Cribs. Very nice. Okay. And we rounded up with some 88 tops. These were the first cards ever purchased at a grocery store. And the 87 tops the year before these is the first ever football cards I ever owned. A uh, guy um, who was a friend of my dad's at work gave him uh, a whole bag of 87 tops cards to give to me. And uh, I still have them. <laughs> still in my collection. And then uh, the next year, 88 tops cards came out. I started buying a couple packs of these. Let's see, Mark Kelso, who Jack Trudeau. Okay, all right. Pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. Got me a Falcon. Got me my Malik Willis, Liberty University. And my maybe potential college football Hall of Famer in Michael Stonebreaker. All right, let's pop open this pack. See what we can dig out of here. I don't know who's in series two. I lost track of a bunch of stuff. Well, obviously, Neil Smith from the Kansas City Chiefs is in series two. So, let's see what we got here. We got Lewis Tillman, Irving Fryer, another underrated receiver right there. Very good. Very good ball player. Oh, Georgia Sports Hall of Fame member Guy McIntyre. He grew up in this little town called Thomasville, I believe. Wasn't it Thomasville? Yep. Yeah. Thomasville. That's down around South Georgia where I came from. Uh, he was a beast. Went on and played at the University of Georgia. Um, he was... On the 1980 National Championship team at Georgia, but he redshirted that year. He came back and played 81 and 82 for some SEC championship teams. And then he won, uh, I think, three Super Bowls with the 49ers. So 
Very nice. Very nice right there. Hardy Nickerson. Old Hall of Famer Ozzy Newsome. John Telchik, who once set an NFL record for punts in a game. I think he punted 15 times in a game one time. Just incredible. Let's see if it talks about it on the back of this card. Uh, no, doesn't say, but if y'all look that up, I think it was 15 times he punted in a game once. I don't know if that's a testament to his punting skills or how bad the Eagles offense was that year. Ooh, Ooh another Hall of Famer, Mr. Andre Reed on the Rocket Man card. Nice. Those cards are always very nice and looks cool. Mr. Albert Lewis. Ooh, Willie Flipper Anderson, the record breaker. Is this where he had 312 receiving yards in a game? Uh, let's see. 336 yards on 15 receptions. Gosh, that was a tremendous game for him. Very good. Oh, Jesse Sapolo, another 49ers legend. Though. Fred Banks. Last time I checked, he lived here in the Atlanta area. I'm like an... See if I can't track him down for TTM. Mark Ingram. Tony Casillas. But my Atlanta Falcons will put him up right there. Terry Wooden. I think that's Syracuse. Yep. I don't think he's in the Hall of Fame. Is he an All-American? It doesn't say it on the back, so. Terry Wooden. Harold Green of the South Carolina Gamecocks. He was not an All-American, I don't believe. Yeah. Well, he was really good. 1,022 yards his uh, sophomore season. Good running back there. And then, of course, Neil Smith sacking Dan the Man Marino. I hated this card when I was growing up because uh, my boy right here, my favorite player growing up was Dan Marino, and he's just getting abused by Neil Smith in this card. So. All right. Well, there you have it, folks. Well, it was fun. That was a fun little rip. The price had been reduced on that, so I didn't pay a whole lot for that. And... uh uh, got got some things I was looking for, so and some other good cards for TTM fuel. And might try some of those later on. All right, folks, tell me what y'all think of that box break. I thought it was okay. I think I paid four ninety nine for that box, so five bucks. I got my Malik Willis card I've been wanting. Well, a Malik Willis card, not the one card I've been wanting, but it, it was one nonetheless. Got another Desmond Ritter, up-and-coming star from my Atlanta Falcons. Got an old-school Falcon in Mr. Tony Casillas. Maybe one day he'll start doing TTM. And this really awesome Michael Stonebreaker card. All right. As always, folks, like, comment, subscribe. Do whatever you want to do. Till next time, y'all take care. Now, have a good one. Bye.